What has it been like carrying the Rocky franchise legacy on through Creed 1 and 2 while also having to balance, you know, building your own career path and your own legacy? Uh, it hasn't really been tough at all because we don't, I guess when you're doing it, you don't really think about it. It's like everybody else kind of speculating on what that is. So for, for me, it was, um, it's no pressure at all. Um, just want to continue to make you know, good films uh, that resonate, that still give you that kind of feeling of inspiration that motivates people as well. And a character and um, and, and character and story and storylines that, 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 I don't know, resonate that really impact people. The physical training in the movie looked really intense. I mean, it's the point that I was like, oh my gosh, how much of that, how much of that stretched you personally and physically and, you know, emotionally and psychologically? Physically training for this one, um, me and my trainer, and we really wanted to, to to push the limits, you know, I wanted to see what my body could do, honestly. And um, knowing that I was going to be paired up with uh, Florian, who was, you know, huge. He's like 6'5", you know, 240, 250. He's a big guy. And um, we wanted it to look, you know, comparable on screen. So going through that physical kind of transformation really pushed me um, to the limits. Uh, you know, a lot of injuries, you know, it, mentally it was, um, it, it was pretty tough, but it was something that I welcomed because I, I was really looking forward to what, what the end result was going to be. And, and I think it turned out pretty good. Awesome. Um, you once mentioned in a video interview that I saw, I think it was last year, uh, it was in your, your mom's house. Actually, when you walk around your mom's house, oh, yeah, yeah. you mentioned that you actually became friends with Sylvester Stallone through the process. And you mentioned, you know, how, knowledge, how knowledgeable he is in a lot of things. How has your relationship with him on a personal and professional level, you know, developed and grown in between the two movies? I think it's grown naturally. Honestly, he's a, you know, he's a really busy guy. He's always constantly working and so am I. So we're always kind of like doing, doing our own thing. But he always, you know, gives gems of just wisdom in, in, in general, kind of like, you know, my trajectory and my career and the growth that I've been doing over the years, he's already been there. He's done that. You know, he's went through it. So just kind of trying to avoid me, you know, trying to navigate me through little pitfalls and little, you know, things like that, that, um, you know, is always helpful and, and, and welcomed. And you've transitioned quite well between doing, you know, dra dramatic films like Fruitvale Station and then into the more physical, um, action-based uh, movies like Creed and Black Panther. Between the two genres, which would you say is your favorite and why? I think, uh, I think both. I think I want my career to be a reflection of the things that I like and the things that I care about, and it's, it's both. I, I like doing smaller, you know, more grounded indie films, but then I like bigger blockbuster, you know, action movies as well. But anything, whether how, no matter how big the movie is, it, it, it's all about the character, and it's all about like the, 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 the grounded nature of it, no matter how fantastical the world is. So I think uh, I want it all. I think, I think both. That, make, that makes a lot of sense. Uh, and lastly, what has the reception like been to uh, for Creed, Creed Two here and internationally? Wherever you go, what is the reception like? It's overwhelming, um, honestly. The amount of love and um, and just just pride and joy that I that I get from people, you know, just the, the reactions leaving the movie theater that I've been seeing, like on tweets and you know people posting all over the place. I try not to read, you know, too many, you know, just all over the place. But um, it, it's been. It's been amazing. You know, the world is really um, showing up for this movie and supporting it, and um, I just really appreciate it.